Okay, here we are going to see how to factor x plus 6 power minus 1 million. And the reason I chose 1 million is because 1 million is 10 to the 6 power because we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6 zeros. So we are actually seeing how to factor a difference of 2, 6 powers. And to do so, I would recommend you guys to look at this as a difference of 2 squares first. Even though we can look at this as a difference of 2 cubed first, but let's not do that because that will actually cause us some trouble. I will have a different video for you guys to explain that situation. But for now, please just trust me that this right here is easier. And we continue. Okay, what to the second power will give us x to the sixth power? Well, the answer to that is x to the third power. Because the third power and the second power, we multiply the powers, we get a 6. Same thing here, because this is 10 to the 6th power, so we can put 10 to the 3rd power. So AK 1000 here. And now, we are looking at this as a difference of 2 squares. So remember the formula right here. When we have A squared minus B squared, this right here can be factored as A minus B times A plus B. Therefore, for this one right here, I'm just going to factor it for you guys as the first one in red, I have x to the third power minus that, which is 10 to the third power. And then we multiply by the other factor, it's just a plus in between. x to the third power plus 10 to the third power. And now we end up with a difference of two cubes and a sum of two cubes. And to continue, remember the formulas. I'll put it down on the side for you guys. When we have a to the third power minus b to the third power, first factor, we get a minus b. So the sign is still the same, right? And then next, this right here is a squared plus. So remember, this right here is minus minus plus. And then here we have a times b. And lastly, it's always plus b squared like this. And when we have the sum of two cubes, it's very similar, but just have to be careful with the signs. a to the third power plus b to the third power equals plus plus, so a plus b, and we multiply by a squared plus plus minus here, so minus a b and the last term just like this it's plus b squared so the way i to remember is minus minus plus 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 minus and the last term is always plus and then just make sure that i remember the pattern right here so once you remember this you can just use them to factor so let's go ahead and finish this for the first one we will just get x minus 10 for the first factor times x squared plus a b so x times 10 which is just 10x and then we add b square which is 10 square and that's 100 and then for the other one it will be x minus 10 so plus 10 because this is a plus and then x square minus this times that because it's a minus a b so it's minus 10x and lastly 10 square so plus 100 yeah so this right here is it. That's how you factor a difference of two six powers. Pretty cool, huh?